So for this show, I will be making my one and only signature taco. You know na ang taco one of the most common comfort foods sa Mexican and American, no? So usually na rin natin ang streets makita. So including me, naging comfort food na po na ko ang taco. So first time na kong kaon sa taco is only my recipe na po din. Mura po na po sa balay. So tungod sa akong kalob sa taco, may sikaw explore o more flavor. That's why I'm making today a fusion taco. So inspired by the Mexican carnitas, but gi-infuse na ko siya sa favorite and comfort foods din na ko, which is my mama's adobo. So we are making everything from the scratch. So from tortillas, hundreds of meat, no? So, so the first step is of course, When you need that, I'll provide that. You will. Hello. So, first, I'm gonna put this on other part of my kitchen because we are going to prepare the tortillas from the scratch. So, so, can you guys? Nakakulang po niya way back first year cooking fundamentals. I'm not gonna remember from what, but I'm not gonna grab it. Struggle. We were we were making pasta from the scratch at that time, and grab it. No, grab it. You can anak dito. Nakainom dyan ni Lord. Gusto na. Ito na isang kaya kung ano yung perkaroon. Char. Sisiyo na tahay. As you can see, it's starting to get messy. Hey, I wanna hear you calling my name like hey mama, mama, hey mama, mama. So while we are waiting for our adobo carnitas and waiting for our dough or tequillas, we will make the sauce. Of course, what's the unique thing about taco is the sauce. You ain't never gotta work. I'm down for you, baby. Uh, best believe that. When you need that, I'll provide that. You will always have it. I'll be on deck. Keep it in check when you need. So, next to prepare is the barbecue sauce. So, I usually make my own barbecue sauce. Okay, I want it based on my preference. Sweet, sweet, spicy. <laughs> yes, I do the cooking. Yes, I do the cleaning. Plus, I keep the nana real sweet for your eating. Yes, you be the boss, and yes, I be respecting whatever that you tell me. Cause it's pain you be spitting. Oh, best believe that. A little backstory, um, I created this dish during the lockdown period. I was having this taco business and there was a growing market, so I wanted to offer something that is unique and strong. Aside from my mama's adobo, the flavors is also inspired from my eat out in Cebu from barbecues to spicy and cheesy dishes. This is finished with chili flakes, and fried garlic, which is my personal fave, along with calamansi, which is a must for most barbecue dishes. Mga higala, mauki ni akong queso parilla. So, I'm going to do it. I'm going to make it. Ah, yes, I do the cooking, yes, I do the cleaning. Plus, I keep the nana real sweet for your eating. 